mesh. I had to like. Right, I got this giant IKEA order a while ago. These boxes are so heavy, I couldn't even lift them. Um, I got them a while ago. I've just been doing some work and trying to sort out the internet. We've got, it's connected. I got the text and everything. The modem is here now. And then the text I got says, refer to your quick setup guide. And I might have that still at the other apartment. I don't have it here. So I've been trying to sort that out. I wish places would just have a call center. You know, I want to talk to somebody now. I want to talk to somebody now. I found their number online, called them, and it was like an automated message just telling me to go online. And it's like, I've been on your website already. Anyway, I'm going to start with the Alex drawers, which I think are going to be the hardest, but that's the one I want the most. So let's do it. Everything's coming up, Emma! I got on the phone with the internet people. They were super, super helpful. I had to like connect it to the NBN box and I would never have figured it out uh, without their help. So that was good. Um, now the Chromecast is working, the internet's working, it's super fast. Um, I wonder how long it'll take to upload YouTube videos because at the moment it takes hours. Like if it's a longer video, I have to run it overnight. It's ridiculous. So that's really good. Also, I got my drill just in time to tackle these bloody <laughs> Alex drawers. There's so much. Jeez, my bad. Um, anyway, so I'm going to get back to this and figure out how to work a drill because I've never used one before. Um, so that'll be interesting. Wish me luck. Um, and I guess enjoy the time lapse. <laughs> I feel so dumb right now. I've got this. And the first step is to remove the USB charging adapter from the base of the docking station. But I can't get into the base of the docking station because I can't take this plastic cover off. And according to the instructions, this bit here is the um, clear case lock but I can't figure out how to unlock it. <laughs> I feel so dumb. I can't figure it out. Um, is that gonna work? There we go. But I can't, I'm just like pressing things. I'm trying to, I can't. Can I pull it? I really can't figure it out. I feel so dumb. It's like the easiest part of power tools is opening them. I can't. There's no instructions. Do I have to press that down? No. Do I press it down that way? I like, I don't understand. There's no instructions on how to open it because it's supposed to be, I guess, like self-explanatory. <laughs> I can kind of like start getting it open at the front, but it's locked at the back and I don't know how to lock it. I feel like in um, Zoolander when they're like cavemen trying to get into the Mac and they just start smacking things. <laughs> what the fuck? It's supposed to be so simple that they haven't even included it in the instructions. Oh, uh, it just, it pulls up like that. Uh, dum dum. Excuse me. Thank you. Did it. Okay. 
I'll be back when I've charged it, I guess. Would you look at that? Not sure why this one's a little wonky, but we'll ignore it. I'm pretty proud of myself, you know. Really got in the swing of things there. Actually started enjoying myself. Now I just need to figure out, well not figure out, now I just need to get into my room. So enjoy that. Now I can do the part that I've been looking forward to. The longest and the mostest, I need to put away all my makeup. Look, that's just one box out of four. I'm so excited. I wish I had like draw dividers, but like, we will make do. I'm so excited. Okay, here is how we're looking. I, at least one of these will be on a bedside table instead. This one will be on my bedside table, so it'll be less cluttered. I wanna replace this with something cuter. Um, and this is the booby pot I made and it is super, super, super fragile. So the brushes in there are more for decoration than practicality. I won't be moving this around. So we'll see how that goes. But here's what's in the drawers. I had to play around. We'll see. I can always move things. So in the top drawer, I have occasional bathroom things so like masks tea tree oil um, nail stuff and a hair removal cream and then I have beauty tools um, we'll see and then room to grow room to grow lips I may swap this with the one below, but I had already done it and it doesn't matter that much. So lips, it would be really cool to put these into one of the deeper drawers and then have standing up compartments. Um, but I just tried to go from like glosses, pale to the deepest, which is not that deep. There's deep ones up here as well. And then lips, pale through to deepest. So the browns are at the back, but I'm... I can't keep fiddling around with them and try and make them cute because every time I open and close them, they're gonna um, they're gonna move around until I get another solution. So lips, and then we've got eyes and eyebrows, so just mascaras, liners, brow pencils, and gels, 
more brow stuff and then just some liquid eyeshadows or like not liquid but you know and my lash curler then complexion products so we've got highlights blushes bronzers and contours um my favorites of everything at the front and then we've got foundations and concealers um this row is the more like heavy finish and then this row is the more sheer finish and then concealers tried to go just kind of generally at a glance from light to dark and then some setting products and then my palettes so yeah i just went with the ones that excite me the most at the front and the top um this is honorarily at the top i mean the front because i will be using them next and this one so yeah they're just like stacked too deep and it's great there's plenty of room to grow, which I've never really had before. So I'm very excited. And now to build my chest of drawers. I don't know if I have the energy. <laughs> I've just asked my dad to call me to give me some advice because these are not it's like stalling out and I've ruined the entire grooving in there so now it won't even do anything but it won't go in any further and this one's starting to do the same and I'm like I don't want to ruin these screws because they don't send you extras so I'm about to call my dad well dad gave me some good advice uh we fixed one of them the one that I hadn't ruined but the one that I've ruined is a lost cause and I just have to build the thing anyway and hope it doesn't affect it too much so carrying on <laughs> Building break to have dinner. Um, unfortunately, Kara's at work, so the first dinner in the new flat is a bit of a lonely one, but that's okay. I um, there's this place that I've never been able to get because I was outside of the delivery range. Um, so I've ordered it, and I'm really excited. It's called Bell's Hot Chicken. I'm sure you've heard of it. Um. I'm super pumped because wings are like my favorite food. So I want to enjoy that and watch something on the giant TV for the first time. So that's exciting as well. I don't need a dinner date to have a great time. I thought so. Actually, I'm going to speak at my son's career day. Um. I'm so full. I could honestly 
curl up in the fetal position right now but not until this dress is made especially because I've pulled my bed as far this way as I can to give me room to make it without having to like then try and figure out how to get it into my room and into the space and stuff but what was I gonna say I want to sleep my first night in the new apartment with my bed properly in place you know so we have a mission to achieve tonight let's keep going I think we're nearly there I think pretty much it's just the drawers left to go this has been hard really hard let's keep going It is after 10. I'm really concerned about the amount of noise I'm making because of the neighbors. Um, and I've just screwed up this drawer and I don't know how to take it apart because I've nailed in these little like rubber nails and there's no way to get them out. And I have to get them out so that I can turn this piece around or some other piece. Yeah, this piece because the holes are on the wrong side. So, not a good end to the night. Um, I guess I'll make this the end of the video because I'm sure it's very long. I've done a lot today and I've filmed a lot. So, um, I guess stay tuned for the next one to see how I fix this drawer. I don't know. Um, thanks for watching, bye.